all right good morning guys um i'm walking to the gym today is day two and uh it feels good uh i feel great about myself uh guys here going to walk checking me out look at that lady cycling to walk <laughs> yeah man it feels great bro basic fit uh so today i'm going to basic fit just to charge my phone and also to upload videos on youtube uh train kidogo and then take a shower check your scooter up all right so here's the gym let's go <laughs> Nice building. It's called what? It's a clicker, which means holy heart. <laughs> it's a holy heart. It's a holy heart. Yeah, French. My French was in French in while I was in high school. Look at that photo. This is a nice photo. Click, click. <laughs> nice. The Sacre Coeur Basilica is one of the most famous buildings in the French capital. It's located on the top of the hill of Montmartre. It's a Catholic church and uh, it was formally approved as a National Historic Monument by the National Commission of Patrimony and Architecture on uh, the December of 8th of 2022. Uh, the building was designed by Paul Abadier and uh, the construction started uh, back way back in uh, 1873 to 1924 when uh, it was finished. Uh, it has a length of uh, 85 meters and uh, a width of 35 meters. The height is uh, 83 meters. The material used to build uh, the building, the Sacre Coeur, is none other than travertine stone. Today, the Sacre Coeur is the, the second most visited religious buildings in France and uh, it comes only after Notre Dame Cathedral. When you walk out of the Sacre Coeur building, you have a 360 degree view of the Paris city. Top is across. Yeah. Oh, these stairs are killing me. Woo. We're almost there. In five seconds, four, three, two, and we're there. Woo. Now there's a waterfall. Oh, that's a nice photo. Nice. And it's a clean water. I feel like swimming. Because it's hot. The sky is blue. The sun is out. <laughs> Look at that statue. White Jesus. Or is it black Jesus? That is not a statue, that's a human being. And uh, are those st the stairs? Is this what I think? The colors. It's all hidden there. There's the building, beautiful building. But then on uh, the side of the rail, let's go check this out. We have padlocks and uh, 
Oh, first of all, check this out. Amazing. That is a train. Uh, it's a Lego vehicle. Turn the number, please. But then, as the, like I was telling you, here we have padlocks, and uh, all these padlocks go all the way up, 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 up. I don't know. Let me see. Let me see if I know anyone here. Um, this is K and H. This is from Moonstar. F and O. Always love and forever. Uh huh. This is Ray Schneider. Oh, Sweda. Raj and Sweda. <laughs> nice. So from this stone right here, uh, you can uh, the drawing says you can view from there. You can see the buildings all the way. So like the Notre Dame that we were yesterday. Then uh, Lou Luxembourg, it's another museum. I mean, all these others, St. Paul, St. Laurent, St. Ambrose, all these buildings. You can see them from across. But it's a good lens. I'm only using iPhone 11. I wish I had iPhone 15. There goes the train. Good things out here. That is some skill right there. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. So, and it's engraved. Daniel and Joan, these ones, they're together forever. It's not just written like with, with a pen, wow. it's engraved. Someone really tried hard. That's a nice one. That's the best one I've seen in this country. The red one. Yeah, so. Very nice right. state of love. Uh, I hope these people are still in love, but they're not too bad. I mean, it is what it is. I hope Nairobi get as a funding to come at you. We can do something like that. Do you feel extra love in Paris? Do you understand why it's called the city of love? I don't see. Just, don't... A, no. Just another city. Yeah, maybe, maybe because it's an Olympic year, there's so many people walking around and all that, but uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, at some point, you know, people holding each other, you know, doing whatever they have to do on the streets. It's crazy. It's, it's, <laughs> it is what it is. Things you don't see in Nairobi streets. But yeah, the city of the... So we just got here, we got here and uh, look at that, Paris 24, but it's a small so gotta look for my size. Thank you. 
There's also oh, one with white letters on it. Oh, but that's a female. Okay. of the shops in Paris you see Indians, Indians come to Kenya Indians, so Indians are very good in business um, uh, just like the Kikuyus in Nairobi in Kenya um, what are the whites good at? what are the whites good at? soccer? oh, ice skating ah. alright, so can ice skating <laughs> and some, some athletics I mean, they won the, the 4x4 mix, so... <laughs> So right now, um, entering the metro, and uh, I'm, I'm from a place in Paris. Don't worry, it's alright. Yeah. I'm from a place. A place. Hmm. He's speaking too much French. Now, <clears throat> I came in a place in Paris where uh, the world is not showing you because this place literally it has so many graffitis like you see in the video. Um, I didn't expect that because uh, when you talk of Paris, the only thing you think of is. Uh, Glamour, red carpets, you know, uh, expensive perfumes, and all that. So, welcome to Paris, downside Paris. Uh, if I see me send this, whatever that means, man. looks like that guy is going to hang out. Uh, that's a statue, that's not even a, a human being. Nice. So I don't see any difference between uh, Paris and uh, Nairobi, the only difference is uh, the buildings. But uh, when it comes to uh, look at this cigarettes everywhere, 
just past the shop on Uza Dawa ya Panya, Kunguru and all that. This is the Kawaida city. But the buildings are amazing, the sights and the sounds. <laughs> Damn, from here you can see the Eiffel Tower. Oh my goodness, there you go. Damn. Ooh, there is no clear view. Let me, let me get somewhere where I can see clearly. God damn it. <laughs> so, right now we're out here. Uh, just got to another location. And. Uh, Get one of these things and view the Eiffel Tower. A couple of units are on the Eiffel Tower, and uh, so many other beautiful buildings. But the problem is, there's so many trees right here that's gonna block your view, so you cannot be able to see uh, the sightings clearly. Uh, and uh, we're not going to Eiffel Tower today. So, Pengine Thursday is when I'll visit that place. Like, in, damn, that place is amazing! Amazing, bro. So you that thing right there. In the Eiffel Tower. So this thing is broken. You cannot even use it. But from here, you can see the Eiffel Tower. That is the Eiffel Tower right there. Wow. <laughs> I am this close. Just the arms reach to the Eiffel Tower. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> ah, that is nice. That is a graffiti artist showcasing his skills and art on the walls. Look at that. That is amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here in Paris. And that is a beautiful art on the walls of uh, the food says, uh, it says what, Mr. Wolf, or yeah, something like that. Hey, look at that suicide boys, new world depression. Hey, <laughs> wow. Bro, if you think you're depressed, I mean, the world is really depressed. That's how I just said the suicide boys are uh, new world depression. Look at that building. <laughs> That's a very nice building, but oops. Looks like the graffiti artist was, uh, was an amateur. These guys are doing this on the walls. I wonder how they get up there with ladders, with ropes. It's amazing, man. Graffiti arrived in Paris in the early 1980s. Uh, it is believed to be imported by the wealthy Franco-American teens who hoped back and forth to New York, which was considered to be the hub of this form of art back then. But soon it caught up with the low-income kids. All right, so there's a graffiti artist and uh, nice. Some good art doesn't want his face to be seen so respect to the artist then uh here says cut hmm i don't know what it says there then uh says death row death row records free gaza this is Sonic, looks like Sonic. Then uh, there's some dolphin there. Then I don't know what that says. Everything out here is expression of uh, how you feel and all that. What amazing view. Uh, 
uh, right now we are heading back to the metro and it is cooling here. Look how pretty inside it is. We don't even believe it. And oof, about your technology, yeah, the trains in Paris is complicated, totally complicated. But it is what it is. I don't know if Africa, what's another Nairobi can Africa, if we ever get to what this place is. All right, so yeah, uh, so now we're heading back and then uh, probably on Thursday we'll uh, see you guys at the Eiffel Tower because I cannot wait to go to the Eiffel Tower. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you at the stadium in the evening. Right now we are out. Outside the Coca-Cola shop, guess what? Another beautiful sight to see. And uh, it is very really hot, around uh, 58 degrees. And guys are getting refreshed out here. Top. I love Paris! Oh, feel like screaming. Alright, so let's go. And uh, 
Oh, <laughs> Eiffel Tower is right, right there. But I'm not going there today. <laughs> I am done. My head cannot handle this. This is too much for me. So let me go rest, digest, and then come back tomorrow. Tomorrow, hopefully, or the day after. And then Eiffel Tower is right there. Ah, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos. Till then, peace.